Okay, we are live and we're jumping in with Axon. Let's make sure we go to the Rogue Lands mini. We're on 1.0.8. I checked for updates yesterday and I didn't see any updates, so. We're going to make Axon work and we're going to blow up stuff. That's the main goal. Come on, fastball me. Cooldown rate's not bad to start. A torque, a, ca a casual torque shotgun. Oh, it's not multiple pellets, so it's not going to be that good. But a TMP will be nice. Yeah, realistic first room is, is nothing that we want to use, usually. But. Man, all of them are corrosive damage grenades. If we might, hopefully we'll hit a corrosive damage room to start. That looks like a nice spinny gun. We'll take it. Oh, here we go. Let's see. Max health, super charge rate, or corrosive. Hey, you know what? We have... We have a lot of corrosive damage. If we can get a corrosive damage room to start, that'd be kind of sick. What do we got? Team fire rate and steady. That's not bad. Five points. We're going to go five in impact because we want to get down to steady for more grenade damage. Let's take a look at our weapons. We, we have room for a launcher. Let's take it. Let's go. Oh, it's not. It's not a corrosive damage area. That's tough. That is tough. That's fine. Let's take... Max health. I don't have anything. I don't have anything for grenades for these lads. Oh, that's not bad. Oh, max health and grenade bonuses for a short time. Sure, let's do it. Grenade bonuses me. Oh my goodness. Ah! I think they're dead. Ho oh, ho ho ho, yeah. Let's go. Let's see. Cooldown rate. There we go. Steady and grenadier. Yes! Yes! Oh, do I, I still have my bonuses? No, I don't. That's tough. Okay, so this is this the rock and rockets we're talking about? Is this this artful that does explosive damage that we're talking about? Hey. I need you to hit one shot, brother. <laughs> Come on. Okay, whatever. Let's, let's open this bad boy up. Looking for... TD or Torque or this bandit seems like it's gonna be okay for us. Yep, 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 yep. That was absolutely awful. We don't give up though. What if we ran? Wait, where's our? Let's make sure that we have our Torque out here. Our Torque shot is gonna be first slot. First slot, most important slot. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. What if I hit all my bullets? We'll do good deeps. No, even if I hit all my bolts, it does terrible deeps compared to something like this, which this one shots. Oh, never mind. It doesn't one shot. Go down, brother. There we go. Nope. Yeah, I'm not getting it. I'm not getting anything good for damage right now. Man, this is tough. This is really tough. Reload. Don't fall. Yeah, I'm going to kill him, but then I'm going to go down right away, probably. I need a better gun. Let's hide for a second. Need to regen my shield up a little bit. I might have to resort to... Oh, here we go. This land crits. This land crits, brother. Land crits, land crits, land crits. Nice. 11 out of 15. Isn't bad. Um, Hide for a second. Oh, they're throwing grenades at me. TDR, TDR, Torque, 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 Torque. I would toss this. Dude, these guns are awful. Awful. Come on now. Toss a grenade down. Sure, it might not kill him, but... It's gonna it's gonna force him out of that area, at least. If he stays in, he might die. Okay, he's gone. Oh my goodness. This is a tough zone. First zone, super tough. Maybe some of this... Yeah, he has to stick with this Vlad off right here, huh? Get some of this ammo back. Yeah, that's a lot more damage. Let's grenade down. Okay. Don't die to my own crows of grenades. Yeah, I have the foundation for my character. I do not have... Oh, a fire burst? Why didn't I use a fire burst the whole time? Dang. Dang, okay. We're fine. Bandits. It's just that I thought this bandit would be good because it, it fires. 
rockets. I mean, I don't have the grenade damage scaling yet, but still, I have the class mod for it. Yes. Oh no. Is this one gonna be better than mine? Let's see. Accuracy is worse. Fire rate is slightly better. No. And how about this instead of my instead of my shotgun? Oh, okay. We might actually have a, a decent weapon there. It's a torque with a Vladoff barrel. Let's see, is this is this bang stick better than a stalker? Less damage, more accuracy, better reload speed. It says less damage, but... Oh, I see. It's times five. I'm gonna stick with what I got. What I got! <laughs> um, yeah. But that's Pog. Sp spinning Torg... Okay, spinning gun Torgs are the best. Okay. Let's go spinning gun Torg then. Why not? Sure. And Metal Storm is next. This is the... Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, we're looking okay. Nothing back here. Jolt Dude Pyrex put something back here, so I stopped checking it, and there being nothing. It's not up to me to adapt. It's up to you to adapt. 1.0.9. I want a chest back there. All right, now we got a corrosive damage area. So let's slap on our corrosive damage stuff here. I don't need to do anything crazy. Just slap on everything that is corrosive and go at these lads exp loader go down you're gone now we're gonna give we're gonna give this torque a shot fire brother i need you to fire okay that's, that's okay okay pretty good chance i die here no i was so close to getting that regen oh i can't aim please stop running Yes, okay. Whoa. Give me that regen. Sergeant loader, go down. Nice. That's big deeps. Nobody kill me. A TDR, a TDR. Okay, okay, okay. For now, I think this, this weapon's gonna do just fine for us. We have so much extra damage. Grosso damage, I should say. Hide while the grenade does its thing. Take a little bit of health regen. I'm already full health. Perfect. It's a crazy idea. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A scra crazy idea is scrap it and go full melee. I'm not going full melee action. It's just simply not happening. But I appreciate you trying to bait me. Stop, stop flying around. Just walk forward, walk back. Not going to do anything crazy against this guy. Huge. All right, let's go get our relic. Explosive damage one will go crazy. Yeah, that's this one seemed the spitter seemed like it did pretty good deeps. I'm not gonna lie to you. Hey, how about explosive damage? Slag could be good. Launcher shotgun sniper. Uh, I don't I snooze it, personally. Alright, finally five points. Five points I can put into steady. Let's go. Eleven out of five now. Alright. What do we got here? That looks like a... It's a scatter gun. I'm not going to take it. A pounder? It's going to be better than the one that I've got now. Because it's times two. And it's purple. It can only go up from here. That's a that's a vertical grip. Hyperion shoddy. Okay. We're going to keep it going. Open up. A Snyder, which does scale off splash damage, so we'll take it. I'm just kind of taking a lot of different things. What's over here? It's Ember Gen and Fire Rate? Okay, we'll take it for the next stage. Why not? All right. There's a quad. Oh! Why does the game make it so hard for me to make decisions? A quad, man. Dang. We'll shred now with Metal Storm. Okay, everyone's telling me... Okay, we got this. Yeah, JV's hype for the quad. Look, listen, we can... Okay, corrosive damage. And I feel like... I feel like the best option right now isn't even... 
Which one of these is the best? It's tough to know. Let's first toss the grenade out. Toss that out. There we go. Oh, yes. Now. Okay. Now we're talking. No. Now we're going to make them pay for everything they did to us. This stage has got me too many times. Okay. We've got grenade damage now. You want wall of lead? You get wall of lead. Go ahead. Blow up, brother. I'm not afraid of you. I'm only slightly afraid of you. You ended my last run on, on accident, which was tough. Nice. Okay. Now we're looking busted as hell. Give me that fire rate. Have a little bit of reload. Slow reload. And no, there's no option to... Uh, oh, I might be dead here. HP loader. Walk forward, walk back. That's the end of the round. Let's go. You should post your live streams. I should. I can post my live streams. I mean, I uh, I don't usually live stream, but I was feeling it today. Yeah. Okay. Best for. Okay. So a purple version of this. Oh wow! Corporate plasma caster. Plasma casters scale. They scale off splash damage. Correct. So we're gonna. I'm gonna keep this torque spitter. I'm gonna keep this torque shotgun, and we're gonna go. Plasma caster. Max health or SMG max ammo. Sorry from That could be good. So I'm I'm if I'm How about another quad for your boy? Come on! Oh. Dang man. So steady will increase the damage I do with my plasma caster. Correct? Too bad it's not a TD or plasma caster. I think the TD ones suck though. Would that, would that be better for for like reloading shenanigans though? Even ownery prefix, nice. Oh, okay, so wait, an own. Wait, what are you trying to tell me? Then ownery quad is is busted. I mean, look at it. It just looks so beautiful. It just it just feels right in your hand. The quad just feels right. Okay, here we go. Diversification. Oh, it's the damage prefix. Oh, geez. Okay. Oh man. South boss team power. Let's throw on a fire damage grenade. I wish I still had my leech that I, that I lost last round. Let's go a a fire burst. No, these three enemies that are down there, they're gonna feel it. Oh no, come on. Boss, don't hit the box. See you later, friends. Oh, oh, later. Okay, let's toss this turret down. Let's just use this quad just for a second. I know it's not scaling with the most things in the world, but... Oh my! Oh. It's just so insane. Oh! Just quad me. Literally, just... Nothing else matters. Nothing else matters but the quad. Shoot a psycho mask. Assassin Watt. Okay, I, these guys got shields. Oh, the shields are already gone. What do you say we just we just quad them? Yeah, let's just quad them. Oh my gosh, he's right on top of me. Don't die. Don't die. This helps my badass. Please just kite him out. Not bad. Not bad. Okay, he's gone. Holy cow. I need a little bit of health back, please. The assassin Watts still over there. But he doesn't seem like he's aggroed onto me right now, so I can chill out. Open up some red chests. I don't want to overlook T doors. I'm still taking them. Yeah. Is the grip. Yeah, let's just take a look. Is this. Okay, it looks like matching grip, owner quad. I'm pretty sure this is like as good as it gets for blue, right? I mean, that looks like it's a pretty insane weapon. Plus, stead plus five steady, plus six grenadier. That's the same exact one I've got. Yeah, this this shoddy seems pretty insane. Biggest problem, though, is that I'm not really, like, the shotgun character. 
I could be. And I could rock this this shotgun. If it's as good as worth saying. More damaging because of the extra pellets, but one is close. Okay, so it's not technically perfect because I don't have vertical grip. Got it. Alright, get I'm gonna plasma cast you first, brother. Drop you low. And then I'm gonna rubberize grenade you. Oh, I only have one though. Oh, it lands. Huge. And this spitter we'll use the spitter to to kill him. Rock until you find a casual of Ravager. Okay, I could use this until I find a casual Ravager. I like the Scorpio, but it's just not its not my tempo right now. Mm, no, I'm not going to take that. I honestly feel like I have, like... Kind of the, the GOAT setup. Two, I've only shot two or three Cycle Masks. Which one have I not shot? Oh, that one. Got it. Alright, so what's our shield right now? Our shield is an explosive Nova shield that can get easily replaced by something else. How about a giant turtle shield? A sticky homing corrosive transfusion is going to be really good against the, the dragons, I think. So we take. Logan Long says, love Northern Lion. How do you know? Hey, how... How do you know, Logan Long? What's going on here? Alright, reload speed. And I'm going to take some shield recharge delay. If you find a flacker, that would be like the best. Because if you're firing, then swap to a launcher quickly. That's me mega damage. Yeah, I have, to f I have to swap to a Torg launcher, though. Correct. I have to swap to a Torg launcher. Yeah, it doesn't fit any build, sadly. Yeah, the Dread Dino... This, this shotgun doesn't fit any of the builds, which is what I'm really sad. If I was running Sal, hooey! Yeah, I don't like the Flacker either, Dread Dinosaur. I don't like it either. But I haven't done the, the Torg swaps, though. So I, I'm, I might be sleeping on it. Uh, I think... Fire damage is what we want. So we let's just grab a TDR. Uh, we used the quad. Listen, we, we used it. But we're going to go without it for a bit. Oh, he's invincible. The actually invincible, I see. That was funny because he was for a moment there. His his health bar was actually invincible. Let's keep tossing. If we have to destroy the the Torg. Sauce of fire burst grenade. Our grenades do a lot of damage. The Swaddle Gobbler is going to get absolutely rinsed. Hey, you stop that. You got to go. Man, you are tanky. All the all the enemies are dead now. That was a quick. That was a quick, quick kill. Okay, let's see. A slaga. Does the slaga do splash damage? Does the slaga do splash damage? Let's see. A rock salt. A veritas. An elephant gun. A hydra. A stomper. A bad touch. Okay, I need you guys to let me know. Does do any of these weapons do splash damage? Does the, does the rock salt? I know the blockhead does, right? I'm gonna take out this Hydra. Double barrel TDR. A rustler's quad with a vertical grip and a Jacob's. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Look at that. Bad Larry, bro. Vertical grip. We have to go it. We have to go it. Can't. There's no time to settle down. We have a slagga and a quad. Okay, the slagga would be the best option. What if I went slagga plus quad? I mean, look at it. And I can take... I can I can boost its damage with gun damage and fire rate. Oh, and fire rate. That sucks. Oh, it's TDR grip. It's TDR grip. That's TDR grip? You're trying to tell me that grip is made by TDR. 
Dang. That's tough. But this one, this is Jacob's? Looks exactly the same to me. That, is that not exactly the same grip? Oh, I see what you're saying. The under barrel. Man, times 20, though. Which one does more damage? The, the filled hydra actually does more damage. That's crazy. Okay, yeah. Oh, look at the stock. I see what you're saying. Oh, so the grip is the one in front and the stock's the one in back. I'm thinking more of like a pistol grip. Okay. All right. We're okay. A bushwhack. What's up, homie? A bushwhack would typically be good, but not when I'm running all quads out my gourd. I thought it was a perfect roll, but it, it's a TDR grip. I see. Yeah, I, I can see the TDR grip now. Right here. This It looks like a, a blocky TDR. Okay. I mean, the grenades are helping. The, Hydra is insane for Jacob shotguns. Yeah, that's true. Um... Let's do Onslaught. I also want to get a little bit of defense going. This is tough. I mean, Tudor Corp is the best. Is less mag and more reload speed, right? That isn't... Okay. Yeah, you know what? Let's do it. Let's F3. Let's respec. We can, we can, go, we can go grenade damage action anytime we want. We don't need the extra fire rate. Sorry, Metal Storm. Let's do... While turret is active. Gun damage of non-elementals. And then a reload speed. And turret is active longer. Do I have any other relics that I could use? Reload speed magazine size. I mean, that looks, that looks great to me. I can take one more point. Yeah, I'll take 10 more seconds of action, of, of turret duration, and then I can slag and swap up. I'm not too sure if it's the overall best choice ever, but... We're gonna try it out. Let's hit up the box, too. If I get... If I get something good for the, for the grenade build... Let's see. A hard... It's not double penetrating. It is an uncapped herald, though. Take some pulls with the box, the cradle, and the transformer. I think, I think a transformer is gonna be what we want. Let's go to the shop. Let's let's refill. Let's fill our grenades up. Out of the gourd, that's for sure. Oh, I, oh, I see. Yeah, yeah. I would. I said out of the gourd. I said out of the gourd before Northern Lions started saying out of the gourd. That's all I'm saying. I was. I, I was saying out of my gourd way back when because oh it's Hyperius. Okay. I got think here. We're gonna take this these corrosive grenades. A corrosive bazooka. And I could go uncapped herald, but let's let's just try this quad. A turret down. And okay, he's he's juiced up. Slag, slag, slag. Where's my slag? There's my slag. Nice. Okay. Here's a question. Okay, and the run's over. Because I killed myself with my own grenade once again. Dude, the drops were insane, though. We run it back. Yeah, we definitely run that one back. Dang. Killing myself with my own grenade sucks. But we're gonna make this work. Cloud grenades more out of danger to user than the enemy. Okay. More danger to the enemy or to myself than to the enemy. That's good. That's good to know. Sniper rifle damage. Snooze it. Dude, all trash. It's always it's always tragic. We lose a run like that. Let's take a TDR. Again, we can make explosive damage work as long as we're. I mean that quad. Oh, Hector's Paradise. That does splash damage, correct? 
Action is tough against Hyperus. Yeah, I mean, I've gotten Hyperus every round. Um, let's take a sticky homing Merv. Sure, why not? So yeah, so this Hector's Paradise, I believe it behaves similarly similarly to the Hornet, where I get grenade damage bonuses. So I think it could be a great a great weapon for us. Let's take a Torque Bang Stick. We really want pistol damage. Oh, a corrosive cloud. Plus five impacts. And a toasty spread, sure. I think our weapons are, are are fine. They're decent. I'm okay with this. Alright, so we, we get grenade damage bonuses. Oh, here we go. Uh it's only one. I'm good. Nice. Huge, huge deeps coming out of the Texas Paradise. Let's go. We always run it back. He had some fun with the quad. I mean, you you guys saw how much damage it did to one of those robots when I got him slagged up. Like, the damage was there. The damage was, was most certainly there. But this Hector's Paradise, it might be one of the best in the slots, honestly. If we get Pyro P or Son of Cromer, we'll be happy we have it. All weapons are like my favorite designed weapons. Let's go. Go down, brother. This thing is ripping. Absolutely ripping. Let's go. Such a fun mod. Yeah, this, this mod definitely is definitely brought Borderlands 2 back to life. Hyperion damage or shield capacity? We take shield capacity. I'm not really running Hyperions, so. Oh, a Hulk. Let's go times three Hulk. It's I'm yeah, I took it over the TDR. I did. We go TDR, Paradise. This times three Hulk will be good. All right, let's run Metal Storm. We got looking okay on weapons. Now we just need to fill out with some decent class mods. Should I keep the Hyperion damage though? Do I really need it? I mean, I'll take it. Because you said so, but I don't know. It's a just in case me. I really feel like the relic ones are just way, 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 way better. All right, open up. Yes, here we go. Uh, steadying grenadier, perfect. Let's go. Got we got our class mod back. Yeah, I did see that Puma plays. I did see how Jolt Stu did release a trivia mode, which. What will I be partaking? Probably not. Well, that's just me. Oh, I forgot to check behind there. That's my bad. I'll go grab it. A TDR launcher. I'm going to take it over the one I've got for sure. Yeah, the best class mod so early in the run is, is pretty big. It's going to increase my grenade damage and my grenade capacity. Open up. I wouldn't mind an impact one, though, to be honest with you. A spinny gun bandits? I don't think that's going to do the type of damage we want it to do. That's a nice room cleaner. But we snooze it. We go next. Uh, if I get a, if I get a citrine quad, if I get a perfect quad, I'm, I'm not taking it. Out of, out of... Out of principle. I took the quad. I died to Hyperius. It's a sign. It's a sign. Uh, let's tur get a turret down. See ya. Oh my gosh, this Hector's Paradise. Holy moly. Let's go. Looking alright. Oh, Jonky is asking why no more COD videos. It's just, I I'm playing what I think is fun, you know? And I... Uh, and I played a lot of it. I played a lot of Call of Duty, and I'm uh, I'm just onto a different game right now. Just playing what I think is fun. And Borderlands 2 Rogue Lands is fun as heck. Just saying. It's literally a Rogue Lands mod. It's a it's a Rogue Light Borderlands 2. I mean that is that is ridiculous. If you just think about that. 
Ro rogue uh, roguelites are probably like some of the most fun. Oh, corrosive damage. Shock damage! Yes! Let's go. Now we go to the moon. Yeah, roguelites are probably like the most fun. Like I like I love Risk of Rain 2. I played Wild Frost recently, that was really fun. Launcher damage could be Dece. Max health, no. So the fact that we have one of my favorite games ever. Oh, let's go, a Ravager. Let's go, let's go. Let's go. Ravager me. This no, this is the run. We lost we lost last run so that we could have this run. Now we get the grenade damage scaling. Let's go. An Umbridge with a Vladoff Barrel looks pretty nice for slag and swaps, but do I play Hades? No. In the words of in the words of Dan Geesling, do you play Hades? No. My favorite Roguelands build so far, and my favorite build in general is um, Hellborn Krieg. It's just that Hellborn Krieg is difficult to get up and running, especially because it doesn't do like ridiculous damage. All right, we stick with the Hector's Paradise here for sure. Especially because we just got our grenade damage up. What is that? It's a Droog, it's a Gromky Droog. The Droog is nice. I'll take it. Oh my gosh, man. This is the this is some of the most damage I've ever had this early. Only thing that would be better, maybe a peak opener. A peak opener could be could be sick. Nothing here. But as far as as far as builds that I didn't really know existed, I think I think axe and grenade builds pretty fun. I mean, we are one shotting with it. I also very much like shotgun uh, Sal. Sal is like one of the characters I didn't play very much of back in the day. So it's fun to like f know what parts I'm looking for, find those sick, insane shotguns, and then this. Rock out with those. Oh, we already have a shock damage relic, so it's not going to get much better for right now. Vladoff snipers, especially the Droog, right? I, I want to be using Vladoff snipers against bosses. I'm looking okay. The Javelin Krieg build... Oh, the Javelin Krieg build is really unique and fun build too. Is Javelin Krieg, I'm guessing by the name of it, that means that I'm taking TDR launchers. Getting super ma super high magazine size with them and then blowing people up. Let's see. At this point, I think I would take impact. It's it's the reason I take this this one over the other one is because the extra points and gun damage are better for me right now than the extra than having uh and carrying grenades that I can't. So. Steady plus impact for me right now is better than steady plus grenadier. And depending on what grenade I get, it'll be better the entire time. Let's see. It deals explosive damage to... Deals explosive spike damage to melee attackers. I'll take it. Actually, it's, it's a tiny little shield. I don't want it. A tiny little shield. Don't want that. Trash. Isn't there a trick to get the mag size is crazy big? The, I think the trick is just to dot enemies up, get your bloodlust stacks up to a, like a bajillion, then switch to the to, the the TDR launcher. Take some reload speed. A low level cross of Betty could be good. Yeah, yeah. Something, anything to dot up. Enemies a bunch. On Krieg would be nice. <laughs> Alright, I know where the brains are at. This was the first map where I learned where all the brains were at. Our first test against a tanky enemy. Looks like he's not even there, bro. Looks like he's not even there. Gotta be careful with that grenade. Killing me. Sniper rifle damage. Dude, this is... Hector's Paradise goes crazy. Yeah. I shoot a brain. Oh my goodness. It's gotta be one of the better guns for, for Axon for sure. Getting that grenade damage. Oh, don't don't spawn in behind me. I don't like getting flanked. See ya. 
Plus a shock damage relic. Yeah. Yeah, this build's going nuts right now. For sure. I open up this chest. What are we looking for? A good shield, good grenade. Good shield, good grenade. And better weapons as well, but... This Hector's Paradise is doing me some good stuff. Brain number two, right there. Let's go up. I think the longbow are the best, less chance to murder yourself. Yeah, longbow grenades are nice. I would like a fastball. That's all I want. That's all I want in this world, is a fastball on, on, on Axum. The skyrocket could be good. Um, I'm not sure that's better than mine. Looks nice, but I'll keep my own. Alright, let's go for brain number three. Throw it down. Brain found. Rackman forever. You're gonna go down, brother. He disappears. A ghost amidst the combat. He moves for the kill, but I'm not afraid of him. Sticky homing transfusion. What's going on over here, huh? Got some problems, Rack Man? I don't like I don't like I don't like you doing that, brother. A, a crit. I mean we could do crit shenanigans. Check our inventory. Let's see. It's the same one, but I don't I'm not gonna take it. Slightly worse, in my opinion. Let's take some I'm, I'm same same build. Same build. Let's see. Nope. None of this stuff. An Anarchist is nice, but we're not taking it. We are looking for a better grenade, though. Sticky Lob Slag Bouncing Betty. Homing Incendiary Singularity. A Sticky Longbow Merv. What is my current grenade? I'll take a Merv. I was really hoping for... Oh, sticky homing slag transfusion. Perfect. Take that. Nothing. All right, let's go next. Anarchist is probably going crazy with Metal Storm. I'd say keep the crit, but hold it. Don't shoot at levels. You may lose it. Yeah, you could lose it. Oh, let's hit this lever. We know the tech. Because this guy, matchstick. Oh, let's see. What did he give me? The Captain Blade's Midnight Star. Somebody, somebody, give me the the rundown of what the Midnight Star does. Is it worth using the Midnight Star? Is it unique? No, that's a bad grenade. That's a bad grenade. Don't take it. Don't use it. People are saying, "Okay, okay, don't use it. Don't use it. I won't. I won't." I appreciate the help. Toss some longbow. Let's toss some slag grenades out, and then they seek they seek out and slag better than anything else in the game, pretty much. All right, what's this? What's this one gonna do for me? I like count for a short time. Sure, let's go after. Let's go after Captain Flint. <laughs> yeah, that was easy. It tries to kill me. You throw it and grenades come back at you. Wow. Well, I mean, I'm not taking that then. Times three shotgun is nice, but I snooze it for now. I want to be able to regenerate health. Let's regenerate some HP and put one point in rockets. I like the rockets. I think they're cool. It will kill me. Okay. Gotta be careful. Okay. If we take power ups, if the pops are nice. Oh, that's a nice. Okay. Which one of these? We go, we're going to go creamer. I think creamer is going to be absolutely enormous for us. A hail? A sheriff's badge. Could we get increased pelican for next round? The hail is good for us too. It does. I'm a chopper metal storm. <laughs> Listen. Uh the chopper, when you start firing it, it doesn't stop. It's got a 1030 magazine size. Yeah, hail is big because it does. It does grenade damage, right? Where's the hail at? We'll take the hail. Put it in slot one. Then we will put the, the creamer in here. 
So we got a hail, a paradise, a ravager, and a creamer. I mean, pretty good. That's, that's pretty good. Lot breath of terramorphous. Fine, whatever. Let's go next stage. Oh, it's sanctuary. And the boss isn't going to spawn in. Whatever. Let's take our time. I'm not in a bit huge rush here. What do we want? Let's take more grenades. 30, and then we hit the box. A topnia? A topnia or a creamer? With a chopper, you can melee to stop firing. Oh, okay. Launchers? Okay, there's a flacker and there's a and there's a nukem. So if I shoot the flacker and swap the nukem, I should one shot, right? Let's replace our Ravager with it. And go to Nukem. Right? I'm pretty sure. Doesn't this one shot? Oh, come some class mods. I like my own though. Slayer of Terramorphous. Yeah, no, we pass on both those. Careful with the Nukem. Okay. Creamer should heal you while swapping. That's an excellent observation. The Creamer, it's still Torg, but it will also heal me while swapping. And now I need to increase my weapon swap speed, right? Yeah, I do. I think a respec is in order here. Let's respec. We need some we need some swap speed. Metal Storm, I snooze it for now because we're not getting kill skills. There's no reason to take it, we're not getting kill skills. Now let's take reload speed, shield regen. Okay. And maybe some one point in this and some points in able. Okay. Now I can swap to the creamer much faster. So here's, let's just practice. Shoot, swap. Shoot, swap. Okay. We practiced. We're ready. Okay, come on. This is supposed to be this is supposed to be big damage for this build. We can do it. Just don't kill ourselves. We I even practiced, okay? This has got to be All right, let's toss a grenade down. Sla shoot, swap. Oh! Shoot, swap. Oh! Shoot, swap! We're going to the moon! We are actually going to the moon. An interfacer? <laughs> oh, a casual flacker. All right, I swear I need you guys' help. More pellets? It's casual? Okay, okay. It's all, it's all starting to make sense. Now this bad Larry. That's a TD or vertical grip. What stock is this? Is this a good, is this a good roll? It's casual. So that's decent for prefix, right? But it could be a lot better. I'm assuming. Either way. So when we shoot the flacker and we swap. Oh yeah, that's better. We'll, we'll heal ourselves because of the moxie. Jacob script Torb stock. So this is Jacob's. That's that's Jacob script. This is a Jacob script. I thought that was TDR. Jacob script. Torb stock. Okay. That's not so bad. Now we have a lead storm. That we could also amplify the damage of using duty calls, and the lead storm I believe also does grenade damage. So. Uh, so we're kind of popping off. <laughs> oh, here we go. Ready for this? Jump. Okay. I hope I don't die here. No, I just get reset. That's fine. This way. No. Oh, okay. I, this is the one I'm good at. Jump. 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 Easy. Jump. Very nice. All right, we go tier two.
we one shot. No, the foregrip is actually is generally a sign of the a prefix. Build is coming together nicely. Jacob's grip, the line is straight to your as a crook in the line. Okay. We're looking for something D's here. I cannot believe how much damage that did. Seriously. Uh steady and impact. It's actually just it's the same exact one I have, slightly better. I could take an assault rifle one, but we're, we're kind of we're kind of pogged out of our gourd right now, with the flacker swaps. I could also do, like lead storm swaps, maybe. Under the, the under barrel is the actual grip. Foregrip is the accessory. Wait, the the under barrel is the actual grip. So when I look at this bad puppy right here. The grip is this is this piece, and this is the accessory. No, I'm not going boom puppy. That's just simply not happening. I'm gonna use this lead storm just for a second though. Mr. Fun. Oh, that's a electric chair. Electric chair. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. And a longbow slag singularity. Okay, it's all starting to make a little bit of sense now. Let's toss our our turret out. And a lead storm is gonna go hard here. No, 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 absolutely not, absolutely not. This run cannot fail. Dwarf Miner, you gotta go. Okay, let's just use the Creamer first for a second. You know what, you made me do this, I didn't want to do this, but... What? How did you not die? Swap. Okay, this is not good. Swap. Okay, he's just not, he's just refusing to take damage, or what's going on here? Jump past them, electric chair. Ow. I need to get somewhere closer to a, a different a different enemy. There we go, finally. Ultimate Badass Dwarf. A, another one. Huge. Okay, not bad. Let's just shoot and swap. Reload, reload, reload. Shoot. Okay, that's fine. Let's just shoot, shoot the, the creamer. It's, it is what it is. Man, these enemies are tough. They're, they're really putting me in a bind here. Um, auto idle or extra shot chance? Let's take the extra shot chance. But I, I want that shock damage relic too, is the problem. So for my Hector's Paradise, I really want it. Let's drop some stuff. What do we got? We can drop you, we can drop you, we can drop you. I'll keep that one. Drop you. All these grenades can get dropped, pretty much. Sticky homing... Sticky homing slack transfusion. Take the slag one. Keep the slag one. The Midnight Star is, is going away. Let's take this shock damage relic. Throw that. Fire. Swap. Am I... What's going on here? Am I just messing up? I get a little bit closer. Okay. Let's see. It works poorly on small enemies. I see. Okay. So against small enemies, I'm going to want something like a... Like a Ravager. You're saying. Or Hector's Paradise, even. I'm feeling okay. I'm not taking the auto idle. It's not happening. Um, But what we will take is more points in some health regen and some points in Grenadier. Huge. Boom Puppy is not goaded. I'm not going to Boom Puppy ever, ever again. What I like about um, this build is that the the, the gears, the, the class mods, pretty easy to get. Like I'm getting a ton of grenadier class mods. Okay. N luckily, most raid bosses are big, so I think I, I might be able to flack them. Might be good to respect for mobbing. I could respect for mobbing. Maybe get some metal storm or something. But I feel like I don't need to. I shouldn't need to. I just feel like... I don't know. I feel like I should be strong enough. If I can kill... If I can kill Terramorphus in like half a second... Like, I should be able to kill a Frenzied Marauder in less than that. Then again, the Flacker isn't really popping off. Let's just make sure that we get our Shock Damage Relic on here. 
Should we go pistol damage and pistol fire rate? Or shock damage? Let's try Sheriff's Badge for the fire rate. Yeah. I don't have Onslaught or Metal Storm for kill skills. That's okay. Don't fall in the water, right? Fall in the water is death. Not bad. Gone. Respect is cheap. Yeah, that's true. The respect isn't... No, the respect isn't too expensive now. I just feel comfortable with this build right now for mobbing, personally. Ravager for, for mobbing purposes. Oh, yeah. Or the Hector's Paradise. Like, we've got a lot of weapons. Like, we can even run Lead Storm. We've got, we got options. For the first time in forever. Well, that's a long... That takes a long time to open up. It's going to be something good. No, apparently not. You got to go down, brother. Oh, there's two of them? Let's just, let's just bail, huh? There's three of them? Three of them? I, do I got more room to run back here? Yeah, I do. Melee. Nice. There's another one. Him in the head. They don't have the resistances in the head. Oh, wow. That's bad accuracy right there. Keep running backwards. See you later. Right, what you got? Sky Hunter. You're gone. Alright, that's all 15. Thank God. Ooh, I can breathe. All right, here we go. Corrosive damage, slag damage. I'll take both. Might need both. Five points, Sidewinder, Long Rider. Thank you for making the for making that choice easy for me by not being a quad. Metal Storm is nice. Yeah, Metal Storm is nice. We'll take it. And we'll go next. How well will the flacker swap work for human-sized raid bosses? Well, is there is there a human-sized raid boss? I don't think so. The only thing close is, is Pyro P, I think, to a human-sized raid boss, right? And I don't necessarily think he's going to be that difficult. Or he's, he's, he's not that small. Let's go. You're gone. Check those weapons out. Hector's Paradise is popping off. Again, the reason it's popping off is because it does a grenade damage. And I scale grenade damage to Oblivion. Let's go. Yeah, he takes slag easy, true. But I can slag him. And then flak him. For double damage. Oh, you're still alive? Yeah. Hector's Paradise is really ripping through. It's doing a great job. Pete, yeah, and it, Hyperius are the smaller end of raid bosses. GG Pete, lol. I mean, yeah, if I do get Pete, I have a Hector's Paradise. It's the dragons I'm worried about. But if I shoot one of the dragons, they'll fall, and I can flacker swap them. Hopefully. The thing with flacker swapping is, though, is that if I get it wrong, and mess up, I could just very easily die. Yeah, I think Flacker. I think Flacker's gonna do well against the dragons. I'm gonna need to put one down on the ground and burst it. Which one should I put down on the ground first? Name a color. Um, I kind of want onslaught, but yeah, let's take onslaught. Get my kill skills going. Keep it moving and grooving. Bonehead. Let's toss a turret down. Plus a grenade. I have electric chair. But well, if I have an electric chair, you know what? Let's let's drop the sheriff's badge and put on shock damage. If I'm gonna be rocking electric chair, I might as well. Hey, go down. Don't put me down. Don't put me down now. I just talked to a creamer while my electric chairs are doing damage. Relax. Don't zap me. Can the electric chair kill me? Should I be worried about it at all? 
Yeah, the creamer the creamer healing will be huge against dragons, that's true. It's a kitten, we'll take. We're still looking for a better shield. So let's shoot some uh let's shoot some skulls. One. Let's actually let's climb up for that red chest as well. The green heals the other ones, if I remember correctly. So kill that one first. Is the green heal or is the blue one? Because the blue one has the, the name. The blue one has the name heal in its name. Yeah, electric trick can hurt you. Yeah, blue. Okay, yeah. All right, let's do onslaught until we get our point. Let's go one point in laser. I kind of want to do some defense. I mean, call me crazy. I kind of want some defense. My shield's not that great. The blue dragon heals itself. Okay. Max shield capacity? I mean... I still don't know what- I don't- I really don't know what skill to take. Honestly, I don't. More, how about more grenade damage while we have our turret active? How about that? Gun damage and grenade damage with your turret active. That could be good. Alright, let's shoot the, the rest of the skulls here. One right there. One right there. Big skull. Let's see, explosive damage? Yeah. We take that explosive damage one for when we use the flacker. Top right survival. Okay, that could be good. Booster shield? I think a booster shield could get us out of a lot of sticky situations. It's not that much smaller. We'll take it. Adaptive shield? I think adaptive shield, yeah. If we're going to be fighting dragons, we're going to want an adaptive shield, I think. A homing transfusion? We're, we're full on stuff, though. Let's, let's go ahead and drop a lot of it. All right, all that stuff is gone. Now, I want to take this homing transfusion because it's, it's a 1.0 second fuse time. We can go next. Mines of Avarice. Let's do it. Blue, green, purple, red. Okay, that's the dragon order that we're going to be trying to kill these dragons in. Blue, green, purple, red. Now, let's slap on explosive damage. And we're going to try to do a, uh, a swap here. Alright, so you slag them up. Let's use this and swap. Oh, one shot. Literally one shot. Let's go. Yes. That's what I'm talking about. That's literally what I'm talking about. Oh, the hail doesn't do anything for me there. Let's see. A Laco, a Law, a Fremington's Edge, a Jolly Roger, and a Fire to the Terramorphous. Only one. I mean, I know the Laco is good. I know the Jolly Roger's good, and the fact that the Terramorphous I have used to kill. Two Hot Mamas? No, this one's a Longbow. This one's a Hot Mama. Longbow seems okay. I actually just one-shot the Golden Golem. Let's get some more... Let's get some more gun damage and melee... Gr grenade damage and gun damage when my turret's out. That way, my turret's out, it'll slag, which will do more damage as well. I think this is the way. Now, depending on what... I'm, I'm pulling from the box because I need a better shield. A gub in a madhouse. Like, what do you got for me? Let's see. That's a gunnerang and a Logan's gun. So, the, so okay. The gunnerang apparently does massive damage, but is it going to do more... More damage than the flacker? The new cap is underrated. Okay, if the new cap's if the new cap is underrated, I'll take it. I just never I can never get the the deadly bloom with the whiskey tango foxtrot. 
neither. I I have only one more pull left. I want to I want to use it on some ammunition, some shotgun, some pistol, some launcher. Can I afford anything else? Let's go with some star rifle. So, th so the flacker will be doing better than the gunner ring, right? That's all I need to know. Now I'm probably gonna be respecking. Still no fastball. Yeah, still no fastball. What's going on here? Does will the flacker work against this guy? Let's try it. So I have a Hector's Paradise for the shock damage if I need it. Alright. Toss you out. Fire, swap. Mm, I didn't get that much. Didn't get that much out of it. Fire, swap. That's that's good deeps. That's good deeps. Fire, swap. Fire. Oh, I don't have it up. That's okay. We can switch. We can swap to Hector's Paradise for this mobbing portion. Let's go shock damage. Electric chairs. Be very careful not to not to kill ourselves here. I wish I got the one shot, but unfortunately I did not. Ouch. Douche. I think he might resist explosive damage is why I'm is why he probably didn't go down there. But it could just be a lack of damage as well. Let's try this again. Alright, so we have this launcher. Fire swap. That's good deeps. That's good deeps. You're not gonna I'm not gonna sit here and tell you that's not good deeps. That is good deeps. Fire swap. Yeah, that's really good deeps. Use that creamer to blow up that bad Larry. Alright, get the flacker out. One shot swap. Oh, he was invincible there. He was invincible. How about we take one shot at these lads? One shot swap. They're gone. There we go. And these guys die as well. I I didn't have my uh I can also go Lead Storm here. Where's my Hector's Paradise? There it is. Okay, everything's dead. Come back out, brother. All of your homies are gone. You can you're spawning them in at Mock Jesus, but doesn't matter. All right, so let's swap to our explosive damage relic. Get right up on him. Oh, I could just melee him. Let's just make it easy on ourselves. Melee. See ya. We know we have the damage. We just need to make it to the end now. So he needs to revive. That's fine. Or he needs to, to get back. Oh, I am quick. I'm a quick lad with this green power up. All right, who's who's doing stuff? You, Barker Incinerator. What electric chair? It's looking good on ammo. As long as I don't fall off the edge, don't fall off the edge, don't fall off the edge. Well, he's back to full HP or something. All right, he's gonna hit me here. Gotta be careful. Do I have my shot? Do I have my explosive damage on? I do. Let's do it. Fire swap. Not bad. Then we can probably just cream room down to the finish line. Don't knock me off the edge. Fire. He's still alive? There we go. Turret out for slag, yeah. We definitely want to want the slag and the extra damage from having our turret out. A coach gun or a carnage. Okay, so... Huh? It shoots rockets? Is that good? Is the carnage good? Is the carnage worth it? Oh yeah, I mean the raid boss is down. Don't get me wrong. The raid boss is gonna be easy as heck. You have no chance against me. I have the carnage now. It's blue. It's light blue. So that makes me think that it's good. I never used the card, so I'd care about this one. Yeah, I don't know about the carnage either. 
mean, it seems like it'd be it seems like it'd be good. But can I do can I do uh, fire swaps like that? Does that does that work? You try it. Oh, a torpedo. No, I'm good without it. Okay, very nice. Look behind the waterfall in the chest room. Okay, most certainly will. Please don't kill me. Oh! I appreciate you, but nothing good. Well, let's take our loot first. An antagonist or a patriot? Is the antagonist better than what I've got? Yeah. Yeah, it is by a lot, actually, so we'll take it. I did destruct peak. What's gonna be what is this one? Is this the this is trivia, right? Yeah. This is the this is the trivia that they base their mod off of. Where is Mad Mike located? Mad Mike is located in the Iridium Blights. Incorrect! Oh <laughs> Where's Mad Dog? Oh yeah, Mad Mike is located in the Bloodshot Stronghold. Mad Dog's in the Oh my gosh, I'm over three. Where's Mad Dog? Mad Mad Dog is in the Iridium Blights. It's incorrect. Dude, uh, the, the best, that's, this is why I can't download the trivia mod. Imagine if, if the game killed me for getting all those answers wrong. That would have been funny. That would have been really funny. And we have this lead storm that we haven't been using at all. Yeah, the trivia knowledge was insane. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah, my yeah. Trivia knowledge wasn't the best. We're gonna stick with the Hector's Paradise for mobbing, I think. I wanna try I wanna try this uh, Carnage first. Let's just try it out. Friendship gulag. Okay. It does absolutely nothing. So let's swap over to this pair. Let's swap over to this Hector's Paradise and see if there's any more damage. It does. It does more damage for sure. Just need to hit crits or something. There we go. What do we got? Extra shot chance or deputy's badge? A deputy's badge could be nice. Okay, okay. This paradise is good. It's it's still doing good mobbing damage. It's gonna get us there, I think. Who's firing at me? Want a corrosive barrel? That doesn't scale, apparently. All right, antagonist is looking pretty good. Not bad. And it's not. We're not absolutely ripping through like we were before, but it is tier three. Hop across here. Pressure plate me. Alright, it's tier 3. Oh, baby. Okay, an infection cleaner. You guys gotta help me out here. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna die. You gotta go. What if I just do this and swap up to my creamer? That should be good. Okay, 10 out of 10. Just don't die now. Wow, there are so many good guns here. There's a burning infinity, which I'm not gonna take. An Unforgiven, which I'm not going to take. Hot Mama, not going to take. The Infection Cleaner is probably the only one I'm going to think about. Okay, I'll let Storm be Lance. I can use the Lance Storm, but doesn't this gun pop off for, for reloads? Right? Oh, I see. Can it damage me is the question. If I drop it right at my feet and chase it, does it damage me? No, it's not damaging me. That's good to know. That is good to know. It is a T-Door, so it could be good. Yeah, it definitely could be good. What do we want to take now? I want to get to Resourceful. Increase your shield capacity. Yeah, let's go top right. Top right is actually kind of good. Just have to nail the distance from enemy to not do max damage. The question is... 
Puma, the saw bar. Does the saw bar scale with grenade damage? Does it do splash? That's that's where a lot of our damage is coming from. Is from grenade damage. All right, let's try this out. What you got? What you got for me? And then I swap. I swap to the creamer. Okay, that's not good. Melee him? No, I didn't do anything. Let's storm him. All right, we'll let storm out. We'll let storm for a little bit. Oh, it does do splash damage. Okay. Maybe I should have taken it then. Cooldown rate, slag damage, explosive damage. I mean, just for a second, let's take some cooldown rates and use the slide storm. Because the light storm doesn't do explosive damage. Take some of this, brother. Go down. All right, we've had okay. We used we had our fun with the lead storm, but now it's time to drop back to the Hector's Paradise. And let's use a let's just use a Ravager. I've had it the whole game, haven't used it once. Ravager, and Deputy's badge. Let's go. Fire. Not bad damage right there. Reload speed me. Gone. Toss. I'm okay. I'm not worried. Let's scroll up twice. Not bad, not bad. There's a, there's a barrel behind me and there's a ledge to fall off, so just gotta be careful. Badass caustic alive. That's tough. What are you doing, brother? Gone. See ya. Bone Crusher, you're next, brother. And I've been hearing you fire this whole time. I need the turret down. Let's see. Yeah, the nuke did a, did about a, a, a little bit of his health right there. That's good. A 12 pounder or a yellow jacket? I'd, I personally miss me for the yellow. Miss me with that yellow jacket. A last touch effort would we'll take five points in it. It'll be useful. What do we got? What do you guys think is better? The Deputy's Badge or the Explosive Damage Relic? Deputy's Badge gives us shotgun damage and reload speed. But having 33% Explosive Damage is going to be really nice. I'm not too sure. Badass crater of bad attitude. Let's do it. Let's go for a turret. Fire. I mean, we have slag. We have slag in the form of our of our turret. I don't need to be slagging myself. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Sir, I need you to hit this guy right here, right in front of you. If you don't want to? That's fine. Hit this guy. Thank you. Gone. See ya. Ultimate Badass. He's slagged already. Ravager can take care of him. Three shotting an Ultimate Badass. Oh, wait, that wasn't three shot. That was four shot. Dang. That's okay. I'd want cooldown for tier three. I mean, mm, yeah, I mean, slag is good, but it's not the be all end all. The explosive damage is what I want. More deeps. See ya. Yeah, the, the shield slagging is really nice too, to, to be honest with you. Later. Turret. Nuke. Boom! How much damage did that do? It does, again, it does about 40% of these medium mobs health, which is useful. Okay, turn to this guy, you slag, and I bag, brother. Nice. This Ravager is pog crazy. If you're making it hard on my turret to hit you, I'm gonna I'm gonna make it easy. Make it super Oh, did he slag you? Oh he didn't. Nice try though. Let's go. Boss. 
I do not want to go down here. Let's switch switch to the to the uh, the creamer while my grenades do some damage for me. I'm a grenade character after all. There we go. Get me up a little bit. Now the turret is important. Don't get me wrong, because the turret's gonna be helping me slag. Let's see, a rapier or a pot of gold? Uh, can I get a rapier when I'm playing Krieg or Zero for once in my life? Uh, let's take some better turret stuff. And... Killing a kill skill gives us more chance to get our shields back, why not? What's the damage bonus when turret is out, though? True, you're right. If I have turret out, I get 30% gun damage and 30% grenade damage. But I've already scaled my grenade damage and my gun damage. The one thing I have not scaled is my explosive damage. But there's nothing in my kit that enhances explosive damage. Specifically. But this does. The nuke stagger is great. Yeah, the nuke stagger is great. I have, I have slag on my shield and I have slag on my turret. Oh, man. And an underrated aspect of the nuke is that it blows up barrels, which a lot of time is what kills you in these runs. Oh, I'm in trouble. Oh, what's up, Goliath? Oh, come on now. Don't do not do this. Ah, he's going to get it off. Fire away. Only two shots. That was rough. See ya. Oh, don't don't drag me in. Let's, let's use that and then scroll down to our creamer. And hope that my grenades do some deeps. There we go. Oh, no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Got a hit. Don't fall. He fell down. No, it's the end of the run. I can't believe it. Woo! What a run that was. I mean... It was a great time. We had a great time. We got to where we wanted to go. We one-shot at some raid bosses, and that's about all we can ask for, honestly. GG.